Here. Come on. There. All right. Shit. The chopper? Yeah. Seems like we've really pissed them off. They're using everything they've got. We have to be careful. I'm not going back in. everywhere. Keep your head down. Yeah, yeah. I don't think they'll see us in the bushes. That went better than expected. to get past No, them. two. How do they escape? What do I look like? A newscaster? Just keep looking. Well, thanks for the help, dude. Not enough light. Come on. Let's take them out. where we need to cross. Yeah, seems like the only way. How long do you think we'll be out here? However long it takes for us to catch the damn fugitives, I guess. They're probably hiding under a rock somewhere anyway. And we'll catch them in the morning. They won't go far. 
I'm gonna rough him up if we catch him, forcing us to be out here in a damn storm. Real tough guy. Anything beats being out here. We'll catch him soon. We always do. <laughs> <laughs> There's the bridge. No turning back now. Of course not. Sneak under the bridge. What? No, it's way too high. Too risky. I say we take that guy out. Take his car, cross the bridge. What are you crazy? Don't like heights, man, okay? I'm telling you, this is gonna work. Just jump in the back and stay low. I'll give you credit when we've crossed the bridge. Come on, move! Move! Move already! We're pushing stay our luck. We gotta keep some distance Just Stay on them. course. You got this. Right. You got this. Watch out for that car. Damn it! Got any other bright ideas? Relax, I got this. Concentrate on staying out of sight. I have a bad feeling about this. He's too close. Just keep your head down and relax. Fine, don't do anything stupid. Who's that? Who's in that car, huh? Over there! Out of the way! Hold up, Vincent! Uh. Ah. Oh, shit! A clip of it. Hurry up! I hate dogs! I hate fucking dogs! You fucking dog. I hate you! Let me go! Let me go! Oh shit! Come on, Leo! بس هذه خطرة وكبيرة جدا حلوة كثير يا صديق شنو تعتقد انت مهتم بهذا الشيء وشنو اقول لك غالية كثير اني اتفق معك واه شيء hey. خطر هي just tell him this is the deal you either take it or don't got it يا اخي هذا ما يقبل ينزل السعر انت لو تشتري لو لا شيء غير معقول احنا نتحمل الخطر هذا لازم ينزل السعر he says no it's too much risk the price must come down. That's not gonna happen. But listen, Harvey, it's not gonna happen. Harvey, I need to talk to you. Wait. You got it? It's important. You need to hear this. Look, 
take the deal or stop wasting my time. All right? Yeah. What's up? Leo busted out of prison. What? I just got the call. Isn't he supposed to be dead? Our guy fucked up. Got himself killed by the guards. Good for nothing, piece of shit. I'm sorry, boss. Look, Sean. You need to find him. Okay? Yeah, but I'm not sure the men we have right now are not gonna... my problem. You just need to find him. You got it? I don't give a fuck how. Just make it happen. Yes, boss. So you decided? Yes. Price down or no deal. Okay. No deal. I'm hungry. Me too. I even miss that shitty food we got back in the joint. I wouldn't say I miss it, but I definitely eat it. Yep. Anyway, let's head on. We should find something on the way. Man, I'd die for a burger. Well, I'll let you know if I find a burger joint. Yeah, you do that. Hey, help me out here. You got it? Yeah, I got it. Wait, wait, wait. Leo, there's a camp down there. Yeah, but it looks empty. Yeah, you're probably right. Let's check it out. Maybe there's something to eat there. All right. You ever go camping, Vincent? A few times, when I was a kid. The old man? Nah, my uncle, actually. And you liked it? Yeah. Who wants to sleep outside on the cold, hard ground when you got a perfectly good bed at home? Each sleeping in a 9 by 5 room with bars, though. Well, you got that right. But seriously, though, why risk it? Risk what? Wild animals, bugs, no civilization, no toilet paper. Fresh air, no one bugging you, cooking over a fire. It ain't all bad. Maybe not. But still, no toilets? Well, that's the charm with it. I need to get some firewood. I need to get some firewood. Hmm. I bet I can make a spear with this. I should be able to find some wood over there. Ah, that ought to do it. I'm a natural, baby! Almost there.
Better get Leo over here to help me. <sighs> Not bad. That tasted like shit, man. Well, you know, it is what it is. Yeah? <laughs> and my fucking feet hurt. What about yours? I'm good. So you're a tough guy, huh? Well, it's not like we have much of a choice here. Yeah. By the way, what are you in for? Something I didn't do. So you're innocent, huh? Well, aren't we all? I'm innocent too, you know. <laughs> yeah, sure you are. What about family? You got any? Yeah. A wife. I hope. You? Me too. And a kid. Alex. I fucking miss him, man. Yeah, I hear you. That piece of shit Harvey's gonna get what he deserves, let me tell you that. So, let's go after him. Together. Look, Vincent. I need to know what your story with Harvey is. Okay? <sighs> All right. I was a regular guy with a boring bank job. One day my brother brings in a new client, Harvey. Let me guess. Money laundering. Yeah. Money was easy, but Harvey just kept coming in with more and more cash, and I couldn't handle it. It was too risky, so I told him I wanted out. He killed my brother as a warning. After that, I lost it. I planned on killing him, but the son of a bitch pinned it all on me. I was convicted for the murder of my own brother. Wow. That's fucking rough, man. Yeah. Sorry. So, uh, what's your story with Harvey? You fucked me over, that's for sure. I mean, we were gonna... Wait, you hear that? Ah, oh, shit. Closing in. We gotta move. Ah, oh, my fucking feet. Just suck it up. Don't worry about it. I got it, okay? So, you used to work in a bank, huh? Figures. What are you implying? Well, how should I put it? You're kinda uptight. I'd rather be uptight than a loose cannon. Thanks for the compliment. You're welcome. You know what? What? You're actually the first guy who worked in a bank that I've talked to without a gun in my hand. Would you look at that? You're making progress, Leo. There's a house over there. Let's check it out. Come on, help me with this. considered highly dangerous. The state police put out a warning today, urging every law-abiding citizen within a 50-mile radius of the prison... Don't you worry, honey. Those two fools come around here. They'll get a taste of old Betsy. Hey, I say we take them out. Are you crazy? 
It's an old couple. We can't do that. I don't mean it like that, man. I mean, we tied them up or something. We really need to change clothes. We can't walk around like this. I don't like it. It's better to get them out of the house. What do you have in mind? See that barn over there? Yeah. We release the horses. Release the horses? How's that gonna help? Trust me. They'll be forced to go get them back. I don't know, man. Sure, whatever, man. Let's try it. Okay, come on. <laughs> Crap. It's locked. Oh, yeah. How do you know they got horses in there? It's a horse barn, Leo. What else should they have? But still, you sound so sure. I mean, it could also be empty. You hear that? Yeah, I do. Hey, look up there. An opening. Maybe we can find some way to reach it. We just need to let the horses out. Vincent, this might be able to scare the horses. Vincent, first we release the horses, then we push this piece of shit down. There are the horses. I'm not sure about this, but let's release them. One down, two to go. Yep. Let's free them all. We need to open the doors first. Locked. Can't open this one. Seems ah, like this lamp locked. is broken. Let's see if I can get it working. Come on, get moving. Now we just need to scare him out of here. Come on, let's get this thing down. Ah, uh, uh. oh, hell, the horses are escaping, honey. Oh dear, didn't we lock the barn? Of course I did. Come on, let's go. See? I told you. Yeah. Let's just hope these horses keep running. They will.
I wonder if I can eat this. Nice. Let's see. Shit! It's like eating grass. Damn it. Right. For the love of... My wife always says that I don't look good in hats. Let's prove. <laughs> I look like a hillbilly. Okay, yeah. I always wanted to learn how to sew. Hey, Leo, there's a wardrobe <laughs> here. Let's change. Looking good, man. Hey, my grandma had one of these. Oh, nice. My eyes are starting to look puffy. Yeah, this will do. And the shotgun might come in handy. Perfect throw. I want to see Leo do a better throw than that. Whew, I'm the master. A perfect throw. I'm the champion. I rock. Jackpot. Ah, oh, shit. Goddamn cat. A gas canister. I bet it still has some gas. Hey, Vincent, get over here. I need some help. <sighs> oh, my God, it's a piece of junk. It's not that bad. What do you mean it's not that bad? Hey, it's even missing wheel. Nah, I'm sure there's a spare around here somewhere. I don't know, man. It's not like we have a choice. Sherby's running on foot. Let's fix it up, and we'll be out of here in no time. <sighs> All right, fine. I bet we can use this to lift the car. Looks like the car is missing a tire.
It's filled up with gas. Looks like the battery is there. Wonder if it will start. We could use this to fasten a new tire. Hey, Vincent. I see a tire over there. Let's find a way to get up there. This could probably lift the car. Ready, Leo? We'll need a new tire. Let's look around and see what we can find. Let's find something to lift the car. All right, tire. Here All I right. come to school you. Now it's attached. We just need to find a lug wrench to fasten it. All right, let's lift this thing and remove the support. <sighs> it's not gonna work. We gotta lift the car first. I didn't let it go. Did you let it go? No, I didn't. Eh, let's go get it. Ugh. Jumper cables. Perfect. Let's pop the hood and try them. Leo, try starting the car now. Whoa! Oh shit! This piece of junk. It actually worked. Yeah, I told you so. Sometimes, you just gotta have a little faith. Faith, huh? Well, I was doubting. Next time, just trust me, okay? Yeah, right. Yes? No, I don't know. It was a while ago. We need your help now, officer. Okay, hurry up, please. Absolutely. Thank you. Are the police on their way yet? Yes, they'll be here any minute. Okay, I'll go take care of them. No, just stay here. It's all right. Just wait here. I'll be fine. Filthy scum! Oh, shit! Take cover! You're gonna pay for this! Come on, let's go! Yeah. You drive! Come on! Come on! Yeah! Come on! Go, 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 go! Damn it! Hey, face it! We got cops coming! Step on it! Uh, can't this piece of shit go any faster? Just sit down, Leo. You're gonna fall off. All right, here we go. Here they 
strong. Hold on back there. Just focus on driving, man. I'll keep them off our back. That's the bastard! Hold on. Does this river take us? I have no idea, but the further away, the better. Yeah, I guess you're right. All right, start rowing. We need to get going. Hey, Vincent. Yeah? I think I saw something in the water. It's probably a shark, Leo. What do you mean? There are no sharks in this water. How do you know? It's sweet water. You're a clever guy, Leo. But I really saw something, though. Probably a fish. Yeah, whatever. A fish. Probably salmon. You know what? It could have been a crocodile. Seriously? I don't like crocodiles. Well, watch out, then. Hey, Vincent. Yeah? You think there are any bears in these woods? There are probably bears in these waters, Leo. Ha! Huh. 
I can't believe that. Looks like our peaceful boat ride is over. Some rough streams ahead. Watch out, some rough streams up ahead. Okay, right, right, right. Come on, go right! Wouldn't it be fast if I just jumped in and swam? Yeah, sure. You try that. I'll just stay in the boat. I think we're through the worst of it. The rest is just a smooth ride. I think you spoke too soon, Leo. Look straight ahead. Holy shit! Ah! Whoa! You see that? Come on, go right! Paddle, paddle, damn it. Waterfall, waterfall! We're not done yet. Left, this left. Watch out for that rock! Watch out! The fuck? Okay? I'm okay. Let's get out of here. All right. What of you, huh? Yeah. So? What happens now? Look. I know what you're thinking. Going after Harvey won't be easy. I know, but I'm going after him, with or without you. You want to end up dead? I want him gone. He's a cold-blooded killer. The world's gonna be a better place without him. You never told me, Leo. What is your story with Harvey? Before I got busted, me and Harvey made a huge score. Bank job? No. You ever heard of a Black Orlov? Are you serious? The diamond? How the hell did you pull that off? A lot of planning and a bit of luck. So what happened? 
Everything was going our way. We even had a buyer. But that greedy fuck had other plans. It's all there. Count it. Looks about right. <clears throat> of course it is. You can always trust me. No, I'm not trusting nobody, my friend. There you go. What do you think? Uh, it's heavier than I thought. It is. Pleasure doing business with you guys. You too. Give me the case! What the fuck are you doing? Give me the fucking case, Leo! Hand it over, now! This is nothing personal, it's just business. Give me the briefcase. Next thing I know, I'm surrounded by cops. That's rough. I'm sorry. Oh, trust me. He's the one who's gonna be sorry. I'm making things right. For me, and for my family. Hmm. So do you know where Harvey is right now? I know one of his guys, Ray. He'll know for sure. So? What are we waiting for? Let's go after him. You really want to take Harvey down, huh? Like I said, with or without you, I'm going after him. Okay. All right. Where can we find this Ray guy? Don't worry, he's gonna be easy to find. But I need to make sure my family's safe first. Of course. Let's go. Don't go too far, Alex. What is it, honey? What's wrong? Oh, shit. Alex? Alex! Leo, can I ask you something personal? Yeah, sure. How do you and your wife manage to stay together in this line of work? We've always been together. You know, she knows me better than I know myself. I was... 12. When we met at the orphanage. Orphanage? You could say that my parents didn't do their job. I'm sorry to hear that. Don't be. I barely remember them. 
Besides, I was fortunate enough to have Linda. <laughs> she was crazy. You know, we used to run away together. Steal ice cream and cigarettes and shit. It's always been us against the world. Still is. No matter what. That's just how it is. Sounds great. <laughs>